Side hatch opening in progress. Go ahead. All right, so we got the all clear from those safety checks. And we can see now that the crew has untorqued the side hatch. We see that being lifted. We can see that protective piece being put in place. And it looks like we are starting to see um, the first crew member be extracted. Um, I'm not sure if that will be uh, Commander Matt Dominic or Mike Barrett, but it uh, it is typically one of those middle seats because they're easiest um, to reach. So again, you do see uh, that crew member getting some assistance. I can't quite tell who it is just yet. I can only imagine what it feels like to have to stand up after spending nearly eight months in space and having to stand up for the first time with Earth's gravity. And that is uh, NASA astronaut Matt Dominic, who is now out of the spacecraft. Um, his very first space flight looks like we're getting some handshakes. In addition to the individual standing around the outside, there's also a recovery team member inside the capsule assisting with the egress. And that is NASA astronaut uh, Mike Barrett. This is the, uh, he's the veteran on this space flight. The other three flyers on board, crew eight, were, were all rookies. And so in total, um, Mike Barrett has spent 447 <laughs> days in space. Saw some excitement there. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> As it helps give a little bit more working room there within the capsule for the crew members and the recovery team members. And I do believe that is NASA astronaut Jeanette Epps, who is next out. Yep, Jeanette Epps was the next one out. So Alexander Grubankin will be next. Again, this was her first space flight. Some, some quick waves. <laughs> Round of applause. And we are starting to see Alexander Grubankin um, be extracted from the spacecraft as well. <laughs> Some thumbs up. And we now have all four crew members outside of uh, Crew Dragon Endeavor following their 235 days in space. Some cheers and excitement for Crew 8. That's great to see.